Hello Stamper, welcome to French's video. I'm France Martin, independent demonstrator with Stamping Up, and today I'm beyond excited. Um, I bet you can tell it my voice. I saw this where I don't know, and I, I thought I'm going to try it, I never try it, and then I decided to try it. How to make your clear stamp stick on your clear block. Um, I used to not put the sticker in the back because that was helping but now I did all this uh, little uh, note card here and see it's still not coming off I'm beyond excited so let me show you how that worked yes it's lip balm or chapstick or whatever you call it I got one here that I want to show you. See, I use this lots and lots and lots, and I never put the sticker in the back because, like I said, uh, it seemed when I was putting the sticker, it's even removed the, the stickiness when you put it on your clear block. So you see it was cut in half, and that's uh, how it's easy to mount your uh, clear stamp. I know many of you um, get... Um, confused about the name clear stamp this come right off usually it's because I'm too excited here here we go leave that leave your sticker right on the sheet now the same size that it is die cut it's cut uh, your um, rubber stamp it's going to go right in the opening so it's the same cut than the stamp so just put it on remove it and boom see how simple that is okay this is called clear stamp clear mount i should say clear mount and what we think that it's clear it's our photopolymer this one are listed as photopolymer so that is the difference so this is photopolymer these are wood because they're mounted on wood and this one, the loose one, the red rubber loose one are called clear mount. And that's the one that I always got problem. It's it, by the time I go on my paper, it fall off. Well, see, it's not coming off. I have to work it here. So let me show you. Let me clean this one here. Let me show you the trick to this here. And like I said, I did a lot. Oops, now it's sliding off here. Well, let me clean it and then we're going to reattach it. Even sometimes I used to put um, oh, um, snail on it, um, the fine tip, uh, not the fine tip glue, but uh, the two way glue when we add it. And it's always sticky and a mess. Well, see this? You're going to take a lip balm or a chapstick whatever you call it and it happened i had the b wax lip balm here i didn't try it one i didn't try the brand chapstick or whatever so this here going to be designed just for my stamping so i'm going to have to put something around it because if not it's going to go on my lips right so what you're going to do it's take your lip balm and this is way plenty i don't need that much i didn't put that much so really i'm gonna rub it a, a bit more now you're gonna put this on top of this now let's see how that stamp maybe i was just lucky with the other one i don't know so let's see this here stamp stamp see it's not coming off is that sweet i can go over and over and over and it is not coming off that get me very very excited and um now what you're going to do with this what i would do it's use some um uh, cleaning mist for the stamp or even just soapy water and clean this and my blog i like to clean it with um and sanitizer that's how i clean my block i just put some see i still have some snail on it because that's the way that i used to use my clear block many times you can see i need more hand sanitizer there so i just going to clean that and i'm going to show you now this is clean and this is clean here and now 
it's going to a lot of time it would fall off so if you get problem with them falling off use your lip balm that did the trick for me i did all these one not once that it came off and like you can see this one that i got i mean it's not coming off so now what i would do i would clean this here so when you want to clean it yes it's going to slide but that's okay right let me remove this let's leave that aside okay now what i would do is i use my cleaning mist there and i would make sure to remove that um lovely um here we go that lovely um whatever the wax be whatever that i put on it now you see this is very filthy there so um uh, it smells very good i think it's a mint or um smoothing refresh i don't know it smells very good so i would just clean my blog good before i put it away that is it my friends so uh, get yourself a lip balm keep it handy by your craft room and when you want to use the clear stamp it's called the clear mount use some of that and they will not fall off so this is it my tip for the day hope you're uh, gonna be as much as excited with than i am about this tip till next time happy stamping my friend thank you for watching